Welcome back. Well, guess what? It is National Daiquiri Day. And when I think of a daiquiri, I think of getting away. But if a summer trip is not in your budget this year, how about making a set of drinks that gives you that vacation feeling without ever leaving home? Our own Danielle Nottingham is at the Beverly Hilton <laughs> with a gal who's going to show us how to mix up some destination-inspired <laughs> cocktails and mocktails. Hey, ladies. Hey, Jess, you know, it's nothing but a vacation vibe here at the Beverly Hilton. We're poolside with Don McCoy. Hey. Hey. And we're talking mocktails and cocktails. Why should we talk about anything else? I mean, not, <laughs> never should, in my opinion. Never. <laughs> never. But we're in the right place, right? We're totally in the right place. So we're here at Beverly Hilton where they're doing the Summer Like a Star series. And they've even got these gorgeous cocktails right here on their menu to accommodate this beautiful poolside escape they always have here. They've got new umbrellas and new fun boy floats and now it's all whimsical along with all that glamour and elegance yeah well we have you here because we want your cocktail recipes <laughs> and everyone I love the theme today I don't know about you I'm not going on vacation anytime no, soon really. so we're gonna drink our vacation and we're gonna start with a daiquiri because it's national daiquiri day it is and yeah. I love drink your vacation that's our <laughs> new motto so a few things about daiquiris I didn't know daiquiris we know right are made with rum and fruit juice and then sweetener right we know that yeah but then where they were created which I didn't know it was Santiago, Cuba, actually in Daiquiri, right outside of there, in 1898. So these go way back, way back. <laughs> and then a little political element for you. So Roosevelt really opened up trade between the Latin Americas and Cuba. And so we were getting rum all the time, but the whiskey and vodka were gone. So that is when daiquiris became the thing. Even Hemingway loved them. And right now, that's enough of school. We're going to get to drinking. Uh, <laughs> Always. Uh, yeah, your recipe, your recipe, please. Yes, so look, so we've got Malibu rum strawberry daiquiri here. Now, what I love about this is... With Malibu, you can like escape and let loose anytime, anywhere. That's what we're gonna do right now. We're gonna add in the ice in our Ninja Blender. A little spill, that's what happens at home too. Let's be <laughs> honest, guys. We've got lime juice. We've got strawberry puree. Ooh. Ooh. And then we've got our rum and simple syrup. So this is really easy. Oh yeah, super easy. And here's the thing, you guys. With this blender, I, I, I've never fallen in love with a blender before. I know, I mean, who would? But this one, the Ninja Twisty Blender Duo, it's so easy to use because of this. You see these guys? There's like a twist tamper. So we're gonna put it on, we're gonna lock it into place, and then I'm gonna go right here to, guess what? Frozen for frozen daiquiri. And there you go. And you just blend it, and then we get these beauties. Ah, uh, I love it. No, I a got little this one longer over here. than that, my yeah, friend. Yeah, okay, so what, uh, what else do you have here? We only have a couple minutes left. So we've also got our peach bourbon tea, and that's frozen. This one is actually a Ninja Test Kitchen recipe. You can do it as a mocktail as well. It's got ginger beer, it's delicious, and it's good no matter where you are. That one is inspired by Charleston. And then we've got the Castor Elian Vodka Cocktail. This is kumquats and passion fruit, and it is delicious. It's inspired by Eleuthera and Santorini, Greece. And this is made from olives and grains in, in Greece, you guys. Never heard of that before. I know, it's a vodka. whole new thing, oh, which wow. I love. And they're friends of mine, I love them. <laughs> then we've got 21 Seeds. Do you know about them? No. So this is like a healthy alcohol. It's wonderful. You've got made by women, first of all, very important. Gluten-free, all the things you don't want. It's 35% alcohol by volume, so it's your healthy option for drinking. This is the Paloma inspired by Palm Springs. Add in some sparkling water and make it pretty with a pink grapefruit because that is pretty. <laughs> okay, and then the popsicle lover. Oh, yes. Yeah. So look, <laughs> these are the easiest things. I went to school in Texas and we would go tubing down the Guadalupe and this was so easy because you can just pop out one of the popsicles, eat it on your own. It's a boozy popsicle, y'all, so that's got some <laughs> yumminess in it. Or you can pop it in champagne and make it all fancy in the Le Grand Portage. That's the Slim Chillers right there. Those are the popsicles. And you said you used to go tubing I did tubing the down the Guadalupe, and you just pop it in your mouth, or you could add it to the champagne and feel fancy all of a sudden. <laughs> I, I hear the Texas coming out of you I right mean, now. I mean, when I talk about tubing in Texas, it's what happens. <laughs> well, and the best thing about this, you can make these mocktails if you need to. If yes. you're If you're getting off the alcohol, don't drink. So easy. You can do this with just the soda, leave out the alcohol, same thing. But, you know... I'm not going to choose to do that. In fact, here in this blender, I can add in more alcohol right through the top and make it real <laughs> yummy. Well, real I think yummy. that deserves a cheers to Me National too. Daiquiri Day. Happy National Thank Daiquiri Day. Thank you, and Dawn, I learned something today. I try to teach everywhere I go, really. I'm, I'm a child of teachers. <laughs> and just in case you didn't know, there's three I's in daiquiri. We've been yeah, trying we... to spell it for a week. Thank it? you for correcting you're, that. You're okay. okay. post that on Instagram. All right, well, cheers, Jess. Cheers, guys. Have a cocktail Happy or summer. a mocktail. Happy Vacation summer at home. <laughs> and cheers to you, ladies. I learned a lot, so I'm going to be making myself a daiquiri when I get home tonight. Thank you. <laughs>